G'day mate, welcome back to Satisfactory with me, JD. So, base is there, and I, I figured I'd just start chopping without you guys, because we, we're just going to do some chopping. I also figured, look, I should share a bug that's, that's that's you know, it's, it's over and done with now, because it's, it's in the weekend version. It's, I assume, going to be fixed by the time this goes early access. But maybe not. Never know. Um, so, if you start sawing something... Oh. It's you. Lord. Okay. You're ruining my example. So, if you start sawing something and then you bring up the inventory, let go of the mouse, and then close the inventory, the chainsaw's permanently on. And I have no idea if that means it chews fuel faster. But it definitely means I don't have to hold the button down on my mouse, which I think is awesome. And eventually, there we go, the sound clip runs out. So now I have a perfectly silent saw, which I personally think is awesome. Okay, 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 fine, I'm going. I'm going this way. Sheesh. I'm going to chop down some trees over here. Really? I can't chop that? Okay. Um, it also means that my kill counter for the amount of trees I've killed um, just keeps going up. Can I climb up here real quick? Before you poison the whole area? I don't know if I'm getting better at platforming or worse. Uh, now where? There? No, that's too far to jump. There's a bug there. Okay, it was there. I slid. I slid into a hole. No, wrong one. I slid into a hole. I might not be able to. Ooh. Yeah, th there's a hole in this in this thing, and there's no crouch, which I gotta say is a little bit frustrating. Because I'm like, could I crouch and get out that hole? Yeah, I fell into the mountain. Uh, devs who handmade the map, there's a hole in your mountain. And I seem to have found it. Damn! Okay. That's why we've got this button. So that means... I come back with three hit points. Yeah. That's probably the most frustrating part. Uh, we're gonna take now. Tab. Close back. I am running, slowly running out of stuff to heal with. The only good thing is it's it's literally right there. Now I'm pretty sure when you chop things down with a chainsaw, they don't actually respawn. Because I notice Air's Rock over there, right in front of us, is still devoid of trees. So it seems like if you chainsaw everything to death, then maybe they don't come back. Okay, so we're gonna go up here, up here, up here, up here, around here, up here. Pick up the berries. Run past you before you get pissed off. Come on. This way, this way, this way. Look for my corpse. It's in that hole. Uh, grab all. 
still have a chainsaw. Oh, no, actually, I don't want a chainsaw. What was, what was platforming? the edge. I'm going to go for the low point. Uh, made it. Okay, to the low point. To... Run first, then jump, JD. Don't jump, then run. Pick up the bug. Can I go higher? That looks very mossy. I'm going to go with no. Yeah. Made it this high, and there's nothing up here apart from a bug. Okay, this down's the easy part. Uh, okay, we'll take that bug. And, oh, bye. Plant there. Nope, it's not some immortal tree, it's just... There we go, permachancer again. Ugh. This time I didn't fall into another special hole. Oh no, I fell into... So, as we saw, we found one of these previously. So that's going to be a special place in there which needs to be visited in the early access. Because that's going to be something... That's going to be some sort of special cave. Hopefully it doesn't have a giant green shoe thing on the other side of it. Because the last one sucked. Okay, I, actually, I'm now curious. Can I climb up there again? Let's just clean out everything go. This is going to be the new method to tell which way JD went. Is there any foliage left? Nope. JD's been here. No, I don't see any way to get behind it. Damn. Maybe they don't hold hide holes. Because, like, these two look fairly natural. Although, there's a way to climb up right there. Okay. They now suddenly look less natural. The fact that there's a way to climb up. Climb, 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 climb. <laughs> I made it up. I crap. Double crap. Oh, it, is that literally taking us back to where we were? Oh, screw that. Yeah, I, I'm picking up leaves. Go away. Yeah, um, I'm trying to think what it was called. So, in the ages of... Doom. I want to say Doom. 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 Wolfenstein 3D. And that sort of era game. It, it was a programmer's thing. That they'd put down these hints. As to what was a secret and what was not. And it would be like. A little bit of wall looks odd. It just looks slightly out of place. It's got a slightly different texture. Uh, and I have a feeling like. It. it, it, it and look, some in the comments, please help me out. Tell me what they were called again. All this knowledge that you have that you forget because you don't use. Um, and I have a feeling like it, 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 it's almost become a staple of like, um, of like map, map generation. That, that if there's something the developer wants you to find, It'll be marked. Somehow. Just be a little bit special. 
something a little bit unique. Um, and yeah, I really feel like Satisfactory's probably done the same thing with some of the things that I've seen. Um, some of the things I've seen both in the game and some of the things that have, have come up on their live streams where things look a little bit off. Um, when the dev was playing around in the map gen live stream and you could see she was working on the map and there was just there was a couple of spots that it was just like there was a little hint that there was something special um, like she spent the whole like the whole live stream working on most live stream working on a cave and didn't take you outside the cave unless you're watching right at the end where she takes you outside the cave it turns out it's behind a damn waterfall you can't even see the entrance. It's actually behind a waterfall. Which we may have already discovered. I'm not sure. But I am sort of wondering how I get rid of the plant animals. I'm really hoping I can get a rebar gun later on in the game and shoot them. Because they're just annoying me. Like 3,000 leaves. This should keep the furnace fed for a while. I hope. And actually, I can change a recipe to turn stuff straight to coal. Wood straight to coal. So we might look at doing that as well. That's a big rock. That's another big rock. Like, all else fails, I can always build myself a tower to get to the top of these rocks. Yeah, we drove through here. Okay, quick. That's a full inventory. Okay. Faces that way. Oh crap, I forgot there was a hole in the middle. Sure. JD's got all the confidence in the world. He'll just platform his way around it. Considering how good I, am, good I am at platforming, that's probably the stupidest thing I've ever said. Okay. Full damage? No, oh, good. should have you know, of course my fit my inventory. The factory that's off. Yep, nothing's moving. Okay, so in the storage you can go those plus those. Oh, crap, I got all this limestone. Shards are on one of my corpses. Okay. So leaves can go in this one. Uh, I need to get rid of all leaves. Okay. Then Alternative wood is coal. And then I have to take coal all the way across the base. I can't. See, nothing's got a fuel value, so I don't. No, clear can't. Which is the best way to go for making fuel? So, biomass wood is just, that doesn't help. Biofuel is just, 
most energy efficient form of biomass. Come on, can I talk to you? No. Okay, I'm not changing it. We're just going to burn the wood. Oh, burn the wood. We're just going to convert the wood. I'm just, I'm too lazy. Okay. Wood, 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 and wood. And I got a shit ton of lime. Which I could convert into concrete, but you're the one that handles limestone and you're backed up because concrete's backed up. So that doesn't work. Uh, that doesn't work either. Nope, it's under the cumin. Organization. Personal storage box. Iron plate six and iron rod six. Compared to a storage container, which is iron plate ten and iron rod six. Uh, ten. Yeah, um, let's just do that instead. Is that all I want? Yes! Oh, that and that and that. Two of those if we're going to go out bugging again. And right here, storage container. JD's container of crap. Lime, 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 oil. Okay. No, oh, we've only got five fuel in this thing. Actually, let's. Take all of it anyway, because there's no fuel in there. So it'll produce fuel slowly over time. All right, so we've gone in that direction. We've died. We've gone in that direction and died. Uh, I think we need to go in that direction. I haven't bothered automating any of this truck station. <laughs> I love it. So that's how we fall. Avoid full damage. Uh, let's go with split stack. Most of the stack. Eat a drive tractor. Oh, actually, we went that way, didn't we? No, we went over through there. Yeah, let's go this way. Let's pick a new direction to die in. There's a smelly thing over there. It's like a, a work in progress thing, like right there. Yoink. Missed me. Too slow. Oh, what's here? Okay. Thought there was a lizard doggo for a second. Because obviously, other lizard doggo never got to us. Orange, just a little bit of doggo. Uh, I have no idea if that's copper or iron. Not that it really matters, I guess. Waterfalls. Waterfalls everywhere. Grumpy dudes, right there. So what's there's a lizard doggo. We got a new friend. So zap stick. Okay. Piss off. Ah. Piss off. Doggo. Okay, I need a berry to feed you. And I'm sure I saw some berries up here. Yeah, I know, you're pissed off at me. You're gonna chase me to be pissed off at me. 
is knots, but you want eight knots, but I'll eat knots. Look at my tractor, it gives me that little bit more height. That one. Gotcha. Now where'd my plant go? No. I saw it. There you are. Oh, and and I do have to apologize. There was the the last episode of recording was a little bit shaky. And it actually turns out, of all funny things, I had two copies of the recording software running, and one of them... No, no there he is. Here. Yeah. Snacks. Okay. So you'll approach the tractor, but not next to it. Get in the tractor. Approach the tractor. Candy! Happy lizard doggo. No, lizard doggo ran away. Okay. Oh, we're gonna just do this bit on foot. Uh, with a zapper in our hand. So yeah, I had two two copies of recording software going at the same time, and o although only one was working, they were both attempting to read the screen at the same time, which was obviously less than ideal. Sulfur. Is there something behind the sulfur that's crammed into a corner? That's what my question is. No. Limestone. Nothing further this way. Nothing over here. Nope. Definitely not going to be anything down there because I don't know I can get up. Yeah, I think I can get up there too. Possibly. Possibly. If not, JD's going to die again. Limestone. That's boring. Catch up there. Can I go down further? Do I want to go down further? That's probably the real question. Okay, if I go down, I can't get up. Let's not go down. Somebody else can, like, in, in a month's time, watch this video and comment and go, JD, you... you ooh, I don't know if I can jump that. You're about to... You're about to find the secret entrance to the food court. You were so close, but you just didn't go down that one more ledge. Okay. No lizard dog there? No. Okay. Okay. Oh, there he is. Approach the tractor again. Maybe I shouldn't have a combat weapon in my hand. Uh, I don't have anything that can feed you. I can just keep pressing E over and over because you're stuck. Okay, fine. Fine. I don't have any more sweets. Uh, sorry, Lizard Doggo. We will be back for you another day. 
Okay. Bug on the tree. This. Okay. Apart from you're going to be pissed off. Oh, and you. I didn't even see you there. So, apart from mean animals, those sea bugs, or glowy bugs, are going to be actually really common and really easy to find. So it's going to be really, really easy to overclock your machinery, should you need to. And to fix some of the weird ratios, I can see myself really going through and like overclocking different buildings, underclocking different buildings. Ooh. Let's not go too far that way. Because that looks like Niagara Falls with one hell of a jump. Just like Niagara Falls. Anyway. I just looked at the time. It's probably a good spot to leave this episode. Thank you guys for watching. As always, what satisfactory is due out in... Uh, i, I got to be honest. I've, I've recorded all these back to back. The two days before... The early access weekend. So... Uh, it comes out two days, I think. I think. Okay. We're going to get in here. We're going to come back next episode. That looks like a cave. We're going to go looking up a cave. Um, and see what we find. Probably more spiders. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it comes out in like two days, depending on... This is episode 20. So maybe... Yeah, maybe it's two days. Maybe it's tomorrow. I'm not sure. Either way, hope you guys have enjoyed. Hope these got, you, this has really, really helped you with your own playthrough. If you've decided to buy it. If you have just, haven't decided to buy it yet. There's an affiliate link down in the description. Um, which helps out the channel very, very, very much so. Um, if you guys are planning on buying it, I would highly recommend it. Because, like I said, I've played all this 12 hours worth in, in, in two days. Um, and that doesn't include any other times I've played and I haven't recorded. Which has been quite a bit, actually. So, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you guys so much. I'm rambling. I will see you in the next one. Bye.